Sean's View Entertainment on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe. Paul Heyman recently had the following to say about the WWE creative team giving us a different look, a different perspective. During an appearance on the SI Media Podcast, Paul Heyman also talked about how the writing team pretty much knows to not, not, Ask him in detail about his promos of what exactly he's going to say. See, ladies and gentlemen, this is about speaking from the heart. This is about having that emotion. They learned to stop asking me to do this. What's your first line? What's your second line? What's your third line? What's your fourth line? If you're looking for me to go one, two, three, four, five, you're not letting me fail the live crowd. And you're asking me to be pigeonhole myself into memorizing a script. And it will not work. I like to interact with the audience. See, Paul Heyman has his finger on the pulse. You're not going to manipulate. You're not going to edit Paul Heyman. You know, you might give him bullet points, but if you're going to tell Paul Heyman, you're going to say this, you're going to say that. Imagine if that was built upon ECW. Imagine if the attitude error was built around that. No, that it just doesn't get over, and you can tell when something is so scripted. You can tell when, you know, it lacks that emotion. You can tell when it's not real. And when Paul Heyman talks, it is absolutely credible. You know, there's a lot of credibility. There's a lot of legitimacy. There's a lot of importance. There's a lot of realism to what Paul Heyman is saying and Paul Heyman brings back that believability in a day and era where there's a lot lost in believability in the current WWE product. That's like you're not going to tell The Rock to memorize his lines when he returns. You're not going to tell a Stone Cold Steve Austin what to say and what not to say. You're not going to tell him what to do and what not to do. And the WWE creative team, I they, do you actually think they could come up with something more creative and more motivated than what Paul Heyman's going to spew out and what Paul Heyman is going to say? I'd rather watch a three-hour Monday Night Raw with Paul Heyman talking and ranting and raving instead of the same repetitive rematches over and over. They might as well just rename it Paul Heyman's Monday Night Raw. Or, you know, hell, have the highlight reel come back. Chris Jericho, have the peep show at Christian. The interview segments seem to be a lot more compelling and entertaining when they let the wrestlers speak from their heart, when the wrestlers are being an extension of themselves, or in this case, the managers. So, ladies and gentlemen, go check out the podcast. Sean View Entertainment, your comments, your opinions, and Paul Heyman laying down the smackdown on the creative team, saying that he will not be scripted. We'll take it to the extreme.